We turn you now to the state capitol where it's been a busy week for lawmakers as the legislative session reaches its final stretch. And this morning, lawmakers are getting a stern warning for excessive drinking while the House is in session. House leaders say serious consequences could be coming if that type of behavior continues. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter at the capitol with more on this story. Aya, this has been happening for some time too, hasn't it? Nicole, that's right. And the Speaker of the House says that he has had to reprimand some lawmakers for drinking at the legislative complex and also the parking garage. And after one incident came to light in a very public way involving Representative Robin Comey, top leaders say that this kind of behavior has to stop. I had to tell her that uh, that she was um, um, this is what State Representative Robin Comey's testimony looked like last week during a routine discussion over an education bill. Understand that she was able to um, I'm sorry. The Democrat from Brantford appeared disjointed and stumbled over her words. Her testimony lasted less than two minutes and lawmakers stopped proceedings to rush to her aid. Comey released a statement saying in part, quote, I suddenly and unexpectedly began to feel unwell. This was due to several factors, including anxiety, exhaustion and regrettably the wine I had with dinner. Comey said she did not drive home and stayed in Hartford until the morning. But this incident is shedding light on an issue that Speaker of the House Matt Ritter admits is not new. I'm not going to downplay this. I have it. I have on multiple occasions had to talk to the caucus or individuals in my office. These photos from dailyructions.com show what appear to be legislators having tailgates day and night in the legislative office building garage. And House Speaker Matt Ritter says those who continue to engage in this kind of behavior will face some serious consequences. And that could include getting let go of committee assignments. Nicole.